guys, welcome back to my channel, Atita Oyoyo. I made mainly made a clip video about my secret bistro, and today I will show you how to evolve pet. To e to evolve the pet, you need lots of pet, and more specifically, if you got the same type of pet, it will be easier to evolve the pet. And okay, so I going to evolve some pet here you cannot evolve the pet that is currently in the house if it sits here you cannot evolve it you have to evolve some other pet that is resting in this tab okay i think i can evolve um let me see um this cat not release button uh, but but in order to upgrade to evolve it you need to raise it until the heart level is at the max level so if you newly hatched that pet you cannot evolve it yet as well so let me see can i evolve this cat of course okay i will add the same type of pet because it has to multiply a uh, um, multiplier effect. If I use Leo, it will just twenty percent rate here. Okay, I strongly recommend that to use this kind of pet, same one. But if you use three of them, it will be exceed one hundred percent. It will mm, kind of wasted, but you know you can take some risk some 20 percent risk to try evolution you need 30 fairy candies for upgrade the grade c to grade b and a little amount of money and a little risk here if you don't want to take risk you put three material pets to evolve and okay i'll show you <laughs> i'm not sure that i'm gonna success or not mm, okay let's try mm. Yeah, he got a bow tie. So cute. Okay, now the production amount increased by 2%, which means every income decoration in my house will be increase the coin production by 2% if I put this cat in a house. And Additionally to Leo, if I put Leo and that cat in my house, the production increase will be 3%. If I put it down here, yeah. But I'm not gonna put it in here because I I think the gift obtained it from the pet um the the fairy candy that we can obtain from the pet is just five per times no matter how much pet we put it in the house so it will be a little waste if we put more pets in here it is my opinion it it's not the golden rule or any or anything okay and i a little recommend it for me is that you should hatch a pet when there is a event now there is no event i did not hatch any pet i just keep my incubator safe in my storage and wait until they got an event here now current event is the premium recruit and s grade staff upgrade so we can upgrade s to ss and a to s which will yield lots of rubies we save um eternal flame yeah we save flames for this to upgrade and to get rubies at this point we got two days left from today today is the 9th of september so make sure you use your yellow ticket to recruit the staff if you have yeah yeah this kind of ticket to recruit premium staff and get these rewards if you like if you like and you will be able to complete the collection and get another rubies if you don't complete them yet mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. okay so that's it for my video thanks for watching till the end don't forget to subscribe if you're not 
my subscriber yet and come to visit my bistro here I've got lots of income decorations available for you guys so come often and ah yeah I off I occasionally sold some materials especially ingredients and purple this shiny blossom here and I will sell I will sell a fairy candy or a diamond if you buy it I will tell you a password to all of my stuff in the mar my, my marketplace okay and I've got a guild if you'd like to join it's I'm, I'm very welcome it's Nabili you can search for it and message me okay so I can accept you and this is my name you can add me and leave a message thank you for watching again see you in the game and see you in my next video bye